The Voyager spacecraft were launched over 40 years ago. They have been through an incredible journey, traveling through the depths of our solar system and sending us valuable data helping us to understand more about the neighborhood we live in. In this video, we take a look at the shocking discoveries made by the Voyager spacecraft along the way. The Voyager spacecraft have traveled an incredible distance. Voyager 1, for instance, has traveled over 12 billion miles from Earth. Voyager 2, on the other hand, has traveled on a different trajectory and is 10.5 billion miles away. At this distance, it takes nearly two days to communicate with them. That's just far away these vessels have gone and they're not done yet. Let's take a look at the mind-boggling discoveries made by the Voyager spacecraft so far. Jupiter's Crazy Red Spot Since its launch in 1977, the Voyager spacecraft made its first stop at the gas giant Jupiter and decided to study the planet in detail. We received our first detailed photos of the biggest planet in the solar system and the giant red spot. The image quality was unlike anything ever seen before. Another discovery was just around the corner on one of Jupiter's moons. The moon Io was captured in its full glory and revealed something startling and unexpected. There were active volcanoes on the planet's moon. Up until that point, the only known volcanic activity was found on Earth. And it wasn't just Io that shocked scientists. Jupiter's moon Europa also had surprising discoveries. Scientists found liquid water below the cracked surface of the icy moon. These were just two of the many discoveries that Voyager would send back to Earth over the first years. Saturn's Glory When Voyager reached Saturn in 1980, it sent back breathtaking shots of the planet and revealed so much. It uncovered an additional moon among many other things. Voyager took a deep look at the moons Enceladus and Titan. Enceladus was particularly interesting because it was the first time we had the chance to look at it, which has since been studied thoroughly and is now considered a prime candidate for life in the universe. Voyager 1 discovered a wealth of fresh information about Saturn and its moons during its approach. Prometheus, Pandora, and Atlas are three new moons the spacecraft discovered in its trip by the planet. The Mysterious Planet Uranus In 1986, Voyager cruised past Uranus and snapped the first pictures of the gas planet and also uncovered ten new moons, too. Just three years later, Voyager 2 sailed by Neptune's moon Triton. There, the spacecraft witnessed geysers of nitrogen erupting. This was something truly unheard of and changed the way that scientists viewed the possibilities of space. The space probes are still moving along some years after they were originally launched, and they are still receiving groundbreaking information and data that scientists have always dreamed of. 32 years after its encounter with Saturn, Voyager 1 crossed interstellar space and became the farthest human-made object in the universe. At this point, the project was renamed the Voyager Interstellar Mission, and it was expanded to investigate the solar system beyond our outer planets. The new mission's objectives were to gather data on the heliosphere and the heliopause boundary, the sun's magnetic field's outer boundaries and the outward flow of solar wind, the heliosphere and heliopause. The heliopause, the heliosphere's farthest edge, marks the entrance to interstellar space. Understanding this threshold has ramifications on our understandings of the Sun's trip through the galaxy, which may lead to new insights about the condition of other stars spread around the universe. When Voyager 1 first reached interstellar space on August 25, 2012, scientists got their first excellent glimpse at the heliopause. They couldn't understand what they were seeing at first. For example, scientists discovered that the interstellar magnetic field is two to three times greater than previously assumed, implying that interstellar particles exert up to ten times more pressure on our heliosphere than previously anticipated. In addition, Voyager 2 confirmed that the heliopause is one leaky border and the leaks go both ways. Before Voyager 1 passed through the heliopause, it zoomed through tendrils of interstellar particles that had punched into the heliopause like tree roots through rock. Voyager 2, however, saw a trickle of low-energy particles that extended more than 100 million miles beyond the heliopause. Because of its up-close and personal view of the heliopause, Voyager was able to radically transform the way scientists understood it and the Sun as a whole. The Voyager spacecraft have discovered so much on their mission through the cosmos, but perhaps the most stunning image they captured was the simplest on Valentine's Day 1990. More than 10 years since launch, Voyager 2 turned its camera around towards Earth and captured the view of the entire solar system. It was so far away from Earth that our planet was just a small, single, pixel blue dot that was nearly visible to the naked eye. In that image and moment, Voyager summed up the entire idea behind the project, and a fact that is both calming and unsettling, Earth is just one tiny piece of the universe, 
and there is still so much beyond what we know and further need to explore. Well, that's all for today's video. Hope you enjoyed watching this one. Thanks for watching.